friends, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a fall day in the life, day in the life of a mom, get it all done, you know, all that good stuff. I've got a few things I want to tackle and get done today, but it's already 1.30 in the afternoon. I'm starting this way later in the day than I normally do. Um, I got some stuff done this morning, like you kind of saw in the beginning there, you know, watering my plants and getting some chicken cooked for dinner. Grayson is already down for his nap. And then when he wakes up, the girls will be home from school and we're gonna have a Sam's Club order to go pick up. So I will share that with you guys. And then at the end of this video, I'm going to insert some footage from this weekend. We did a whole garage makeover, nothing crazy. We just really needed to get in there and organize and clean stuff out, get rid of stuff that was taking up too much space because we want to be able to put our cars in there this winter and our cars, we have a minivan and a Prius. So like, it's not like we have two huge cars or anything. Like obviously my car's big, but the Prius isn't. They still barely fit. We spent like 20 minutes back and forth, in and out, trying different configurations, moving more stuff in the garage around, but we figured out a way that they'll both fit and it's a tight fit, but you know what? It's better than leaving them out in the snow and having to clean our cars off every day because that is not fun. So yeah, I'm gonna insert that footage at the end, show you the before and afters. And I am so happy with it because when we first moved in, we've only been here for like three months now, but when we first moved in, we kind of just put stuff up on the shelves and arranged stuff in a certain way, but like not a good, what's the word I'm looking for? Like functional way. So that is what we did this weekend and I'm super happy with how it turned out. And now I am going to head into the kitchen to tidy up. I'm going to make some apple cinnamon quick bread. It sounds perfect for a fall snack. And I also have some really cute drinking glasses I wanna show you guys. And also from the same company, new soap dispensers. Why can't words work for me today? My gosh, I'll show you. Let's just, let's go over to the kitchen. <laughs> okay, so the first thing I'm gonna show you guys are these adorable glasses. So these are can glasses. So you can see they're shaped like a can. They're the size of a can, but how cute are these these were sent to me from heartland lettering i will have the website linked down below she was kind enough to send me these and then the other thing i'm going to show you and honestly like i'm not just saying this i genuinely have so many things i want from this shop for christmas decor and just other decor in general and these are the other things that i got it came with the tray she has a wide variety of different types of bottles different fonts, different colored bottles. I just really liked these because I thought they would be perfect to tie in with fall decor. And then just the black accents work really well with my kitchen in general. She also has these type of bottles with the cute labels and stuff for shampoo and conditioner. There is so much more. I Like I said, I will have the website linked down below. Check them out. Let me know if you order anything from them. I promise you will not be disappointed. Already running into an issue here. I didn't realize this recipe calls for a half cup of applesauce. I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna do because the only applesauce we have, apple peach, which probably wouldn't be terrible, or we have one apple multi-fruit, and then I also have, <laughs> I mean, I guess I have these strawberry applesauce they literally expire today and then i also have a couple of grayson's pouches i have palm peach applesauce which is apple peach and sweet potato and i have a apple carrot and mixed berry so i don't know what i'm gonna do but i need to figure it out so i'm about to make this apple cinnamon quick bread we have mm. and i didn't realize that it takes half a cup of applesauce and obviously we don't have any regular applesauce. Any applesauce will do. It won't take, the cinnamon will overpower anything, to be honest. Okay, so should I just use these two apple peach ones, do you think?
guys. It says batter may be lumpy. It is lumpy and thick. I don't know if you can tell. They are not lying. Smells delicious though. And I tasted the applesauce and I didn't taste taste any peach. Um, I didn't take a huge taste, but I think it'll be fine. So I'm about to take the rest of the chicken out. I used a little bit with my lunch on my salad, but <laughs> this is for dinner tonight. So you're probably like, what on earth? The other night we had like no groceries. Chad and I were starving. The kids were already all in bed. And so he just threw together this pasta. He cooked the ramen and used a little bit of the seasoning, but then added like other seasonings used that alfredo sauce and some chicken he cooked up with seasoning on it and it was really good and it was such an easy like pantry meal that it like sparked this idea that i kind of want to try to do that more often and then maybe put it all in a video for you so let me know if you guys would want to see that i think it's a really good idea we are a very budget friendly household you guys know that if you've seen my videos before but yeah the girls loved it and they only got to have a little bit of leftovers and Madeline has been begging for days to make it and to make it with him. So that is what we're going to do tonight. That's why I've got the chicken cooking. I figured I would save him a step and just cook it in the crock pot so that it's ready for later. And it cooked really fast because it's just the tenderloins. So I'm going to get the rest of the pieces out here. Put them in here and then that'll be ready to go for later. So this was a very small Sam's Club order. I really needed just Toilet paper, Grayson's diapers, but I got these because these are the best. And then I was really craving buffalo chicken dip, but I didn't want to make it and buy all the ingredients to make it. So I got this Members Mark brand and some chips. Somebody out here is enjoying the new garage setup, aren't you? <laughs> yes. Is it comfy? Yes. Do you want to lay on that side instead so you can like see outside? Yes. So you have a view. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, that looks cozy. <laughs> so I wanted to show you guys the finished product of the bread. You see, we've already broken into it. It's really good. And to go with the pasta tonight, I just put these in the oven. I haven't had these in so long. I am going to quickly clean this up because still, even in a new house, not in our apartment anymore, we have more space here. This is still becoming the catch-all spot, this table. So, I'm gonna tidy this up real quick before dinner. Why you wanna let me go, not nah, nah, now? Are you saying that to change your mind? For love or pity, let me know, not nah, nah, now. Cause your love made me, made me go blind. What am I hearing? Saying you're moving back When were you gonna tell me that? What am I hearing? It feels like a heart attack Someone help me catch my breath again How did you stop loving me? How is that even possible? Bread. Good job. <laughs> it's 
funny. Stitchy. I'm happy that we. Did you just say stitchy? Uh -huh. You want a peanut butter sandwich? Yay! <laughs> say thank you. Yeah. Yummy? Well, you're gonna open it. No, just eat it. There you go. Alright, turn it upside down and dump it on in. <laughs> careful, it's heavy. Shake it a little bit. Get all of it in there. Oh, careful. I gotta check the bread in a second, so when she's done stirring. You're still gonna stir it hard. Careful, because this can get hot, sweetie. Yeah, here, turn it like this. You can grab it inside. Don't stir too hard. You don't need to actually start. You're just moving it around a little bit, okay? Okay. I'm in the All I did is for me, can you go get my candle? Please? You don't need it right now if you're cooking. You're just tasting the sauce. Good. I'm still doing the bread. Until you came, I was breathless when we first met. Couldn't keep my hands away. I was speechless when we first met. Yeah, you took the pain away. Didn't mind my scars, mend my broken heart. Life was dull until you came. before idea so yard stuff pretty sure he said we're gonna get rid of this ladder this is a big area that's been driving me crazy this shelf has been driving us both crazy it's a big one we need to take care of so yeah we've got our work cut out for us, for sure. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see the world in action, what we can be. 
Life with no distractions, we'll get away This is what we waited for